Propriety. Accordance with recognized usage, custom, or principles. Propulsion. A driving onward or forward. Prosaic. Unimaginative. Proscenium. That part of the stage between the curtain and the orchestra. Proscribe. To reject as a teaching or a practice with condemnation or denunciation. Proscription. Any act of condemnation and rejection from favor and privilege. Proselyte. One who has been won over from one religious belief to another. Prosody. The science of poetical forms. Prospector. One who makes exploration, search, or examination, especially for minerals. Prospectus. A paper or pamphlet containing information of a proposed undertaking. Prostrate. Lying prone or with the head to the ground. Protagonist. A leader in any enterprise or contest. Protection. Preservation from harm, danger, annoyance, or any other evil. Protective. Sheltering. Protector. A defender. Protege. One specially cared for and favored by another, usually older person. Protestant. A Christian who denies the authority of the Pope and holds the right of special judgment. Proto-martyr. The earliest victim in any cause. Protocol. A declaration or memorandum of agreement less solemn and formal than a treaty. Protoplasm. The substance that forms the principal portion of an animal or vegetable cell. Prototype. A work original in character, afterward imitated in form or spirit. Protract. To prolong. Protrude. To push out or thrust forth. Protrusion. The act of protruding. Protuberance. Something that swells out from a surrounding surface. Protuberant. Bulging. Protuberate. To swell or bulge beyond the surrounding surface. Proverb. A brief, pithy saying condensing in witty or striking form the wisdom of experience. Provident. Anticipating and making ready for future wants or emergencies. Providential. Affected by divine guidance. Provincial. Uncultured in thought and manner. Proviso. A clause in a contract, will, etc., by which its operation is rendered conditional. Provocation. An action or mode of conduct that excites resentment. Prowess. Strength, skill, and intrepidity in battle. Proximately. Immediately. Proxy. A person who is empowered by another to represent him or her in a given matter. Prudence. Caution. Prudential. Proceeding or marked by caution. Prudery. An undue display of modesty or delicacy. Prurient. Inclined to lascivious thoughts and desires. Pseudapostol. A pretended or false apostle. Pseudonym. A fictitious name, especially when assumed by a writer. Pseudonymity. The state or character of using a fictitious name. Psychiatry. The branch of medicine that relates to mental disease. Psychic. Pertaining to the mind or soul. Psychopathic. Morally irresponsible. Psychotherapy. The treatment of mental disease. Pudgy. Small and fat. Pural. Childish. Pugnacious. Quarrelsome. Puissant. Possessing strength. Pulmonary. Relating to the lungs. Punctilious. Strictly observant of the rules or forms prescribed by law or custom. Punctual. Observant and exact in points of time. Pungent. Affecting the sense of smell. Pungency. The quality of affecting the sense of smell. Punitive. Pertaining to punishment. Pupillage. The state or period of being a student. Purgatory. 
an intermediate state where souls are made fit for paradise or heaven by expiatory suffering. Pearl, to cause to whirl, as in an eddy. Purloin, to steal. Purport, intent. Purveyor, one who supplies. Pusillanimous, without spirit or bravery. Putrescent, undergoing decomposition of animal or vegetable matter accompanied by fetid odors. Pyre, a heap of combustibles arranged for burning a dead body. Pyromania, an insane propensity to set things on fire. Pyrotechnic, pertaining to fireworks or their manufacture. Pix, a vessel or casket usually of precious metal in which the host is preserved. Quackery, charlatanry, quadrate, to divide into quarters. Quadruple, to multiply by four. Qualification, a requisite for an employment, position, right, or privilege. Qualify, to endow or furnish with requisite ability, character, knowledge, skill, or possessions. Qualm, a fit of nausea. Quandary, a puzzling predicament. Quantity, magnitude. Quarantine, the enforced isolation of any person or place infected with contagious disease. Quarrelsome, irascible. Quarter, one of four equal parts into which anything is or may be divided. Quarterly, occurring or made at intervals of three months. Quartet, a composition for four voices or four instruments. Quarto, an eight-page newspaper of any size. Key, a wharf or artificial landing place on the shore of a harbor or projecting into it. Querulous, habitually complaining. Query, to make inquiry. Q, a file of persons waiting in order of their arrival, as for admittance. Quibble, an utterly trivial distinction or objection. Quiescence, quiet. Quiescent, being in a state of repose or inaction. Quiet, making no noise. Quietus, a silencing, suppressing, or ending. Quintessence, the most essential part of anything. Quintet, musical composition arranged for five voices or instruments. Quite, fully. Quixotic, chivalrous or romantic to a ridiculous or extravagant degree. Rabid, affected with rabies or hydrophobia. Racy, exciting or exhilarating to the mind. Radiance, brilliant or sparkling luster. Radiate, to extend in all directions, as from a source or focus. Radical, one who holds extreme views or advocates extreme measures. Radix, that from or on which something is developed. Raillery, good-humored satire. Ramify, to divide or subdivide into branches or subdivisions. Ramos, branch-like. Rampant, growing, climbing, or running without check or restraint. Rampart, a bulwark or construction to oppose assault or hostile entry. Rancor, malice. Rankle, to produce irritation or festering. Rapacious, disposed to seize by violence or by unlawful or greedy methods. Rapid, having great speed. Rapin, the act of seizing and carrying off property by superior force, as in war. Rapt, enraptured. Reptorial, seizing and devouring living prey. Ration, to provide with a fixed allowance or portion, especially of food. Rationalism, the formation of opinions by relying upon reason alone, independently of authority. 
raucous, harsh. Ravage, to lay waste by pillage, rapine, devouring, or other destructive methods. Ravenous, furiously voracious or hungry. Ravine, a deep gorge or hollow, especially one worn by a stream or flow of water. Reaction, tendency towards a former or opposite state of things, as after reform, revolution, or inflation. Reactionary, pertaining to, of the nature of, causing or favoring reaction. Readily, without objection or reluctance. Readjust, to put in order after disarrangement. Ready, in a state of preparedness for any given purpose or occasion. Realism, the principle and practice of depicting persons and scenes as they are believed really to exist. Rearrange, to arrange again or in a different order. Reassure, to give new confidence. Rebellious, insubordinate. Rebuff, a peremptory or unexpected rejection of advances or approaches. Rebuild, to build again or anew. Rebut, to oppose by argument or a sufficient answer. Recant, to withdraw formally one's belief in something previously believed or maintained. Recapitulate, to repeat again the principal points of. Recapture, to capture again. Recede, to move back or away. Receivable, capable of being or fit to be received, often money. Receptive, having the capacity, quality, or ability of receiving as truths or impressions. Recessive, having a tendency to go back. Recidivist, a confirmed criminal. Reciprocal, mutually interchangeable or convertible. Reciprocate, to give and take mutually. Reciprocity, equal mutual rights and benefits granted and enjoyed. Recitation, the act of reciting or repeating, especially in public and from memory. Rec, to have a care or thought for. Reckless, foolishly heedless of danger. Reclaim, to demand or to obtain the return or restoration of. Recline, to cause to assume a leaning or recumbent attitude or position. Recluse, one who lives in retirement or seclusion. Reclusory, a hermitage. Recognizance, an acknowledgement entered into before a court with condition to do some particular act. Recognize, to recall the identity of a person or thing. Recoil, to start back as in dismay, loathing, or dread. Recollect, to recall the knowledge of. Reconcilable, capable of being adjusted or harmonized. Reconnoiter, to make a preliminary examination of for military, surveying, or geological purposes. Reconsider, to review with care, especially with a view to a reversal of previous action. Reconstruct, to rebuild. Recourse. Resort to or application for help in exigency or trouble. Recover. To regain. Recreant. A cowardly or faithless person. Recreate. To refresh after labor. Recrudescence. The state of being raw or sore again. Recrudescent. Becoming raw or sore again. Recruit. To enlist men for military or naval service. Rectify. To correct. Rectitude. The quality of being upright in principles and conduct. Recuperate. To recover. Recur. To happen again or repeatedly, especially at regular intervals. Recure. To cure again. Recurrent, returning from time to time, especially at regular or stated intervals. Redemption, the recovery of what is mortgaged or pledged by paying the debt. Redolent, smelling sweet and agreeable. 
Redolence, smelling sweet and agreeable. Redoubtable, formidable. Redound, rebound. Redress, to set right as a wrong by compensation or the punishment of the wrongdoer. Reducible, that may be reduced. Redundance, excess. Redundant, constituting an excess. Re-establish, to restore. Refer, to direct or send for information or other purpose. Referrer, one who refers. Referable, ascribable. Referee, an umpire. Refinery, a place where some crude material, as sugar or petroleum, is purified. Reflectable, capable of being turned back. Reflection, the throwing off or back of light, heat, sound, or any form of energy that travels in waves. Reflector, a mirror as of metal for reflecting light, heat, or sound in a particular direction. Reflexible, capable of being reflected. Reform, change for the better. Reformer, one who carries out a reform. Refract, to bend or turn from a direct course. Refractory, not amenable to control. Refragable, capable of being refuted. Refringency, power to refract. Refringent, having the power to refract. Refusal, denial of what is asked. Asked, refute, to prove to be wrong. Regale, to give unusual pleasure. Regalia, the emblems of royalty. Regality, royalty. Regenerate, to reproduce. Regent, one who is lawfully deputized to administer the government for the time being in the name of the ruler. Regicide, the killing of a king or sovereign. Regime, particular conduct or administration of affairs. Regimen, a systemized order or course of living with reference to food, clothing, and personal habits. Regiment, a body of soldiers. Regnant, exercising royal authority in one's own right. Regress, to return to a former place or condition. Regretful, feeling expressive of or full of regret. Rehabilitate, to restore to a former status, capacity, right, rank, or privilege. Reign, to hold and exercise foreign power. Reimburse, to pay back as an equivalent of what has been expended. Rain, a step attached to the bit for controlling a horse or other draft animal. Reinstate, to restore to a former state, station, or authority. Reiterate, to say or do again and again. Rejoin, to reunite after separation. Rejuvenate, to restore to youth. Rejuvenescence, a renewal of youth. Relapse, to suffer a return of a disease after partial recovery. Relegate, to send off or consign as to an obscure position or remote destination. Relent, to yield. Relevant, bearing upon the matter in hand. Reliance, dependence. Reliant, Having confidence. Relinquish. To give up using or having. Reliquary. A casket, coffer, or repository in which relics are kept. Relish. To like the taste or savor of. Reluctance. Unwillingness. Reluctant. Unwilling. Remembrance. Recollection. Reminiscence. The calling to mind of incidents within the range of personal knowledge or experience. Reminiscent, pertaining to the recollection of matters of personal interest. Remiss, negligent. Remission, temporary diminution of a disease. Remodel, reconstruct. Remonstrance, 
reproof. Remonstrant, having the character of a reproof. Remonstrate, to present a verbal or written protest to those who have the power to right or prevent a wrong. Remunerate, to pay or pay for. Remuneration, compensation. Renaissance, the revival of letters and then of art which marks the transition from medieval to modern time. Rendezvous, a prearranged place of meeting. Rendition, interpretation. Renovate, to restore after deterioration, as a building. Renunciation, an explicit disclaimer of a right or privilege. Reorganize, to change to a more satisfactory form of organization. Reparable, capable of repair. Reparation, the act of making amends as for an entry, loss, or wrong. Repartee, a ready, witty, or apt reply. Repeal, to render of no further effect. Repel, to force or keep back in a manner, physically or mentally. Repellent, having power to force back in a manner, physically or mentally. Repentance, sorrow for something done or left undone, with desire to make things right by undoing the wrong. Repertory, a place where things are stored or gathered together. Repetition, the act of repeating. Repine, to indulge in fretfulness and fault-finding. Replenish, to fill again as something that has been emptied. Replete, full to the uttermost. Replica, a duplicate executed by the artist himself and regarded equally with the first as an original. Repository, a place in which goods are stored. Reprehend, to find fault with. Reprehensible, censurable. Reprehension, expression of blame. Repress, to keep under restraint or control. Repressible, able to be kept under restraint or control. Reprieve, to grant a respite from punishment to. Reprimand, to chide or rebuke for a fault. Reprisal, any infliction or act by way of retaliation on an enemy. Reprobate, one abandoned to depravity and sin. Reproduce, to make a copy of. Reproduction, the process by which an animal or plant gives rise to another of its kind. kind. Reproof, an expression of disapproval or blame personally addressed to one censured. Repudiate, to refuse to have anything to do with. Repugnance, thorough dislike. Repugnant, offensive to taste and feeling. Repulse, the act of beating or driving back as an attacking or advancing enemy. Repulsive, grossly offensive. Repute, to hold in general opinion. Requiem, a solemn mass sung for the repose of the souls of the dead. Requisite, necessary. Requital, adequate return for good or ill. Requite, to repay either good or evil to, as to a person. Rescind, to make void, as an act, by the enacting authority or a superior authority. Receipt, to place in position of office again. Resemblance, similarity in quality or form. Resent, to be indignant at, as an injury or insult. Reservoir, a receptacle where a quantity of some material, especially of a liquid or gas, may be kept. Residue, a remainder or surplus after a part has been separated or otherwise treated. Resilience, the power of springing back to a former position. Resilient, having the quality of springing back to a former position. Resistance, the exertion of opposite effort or effect. Resistant, offering or tending to produce resistance. Resistive, having or exercising the power of resistance. 
resistless, powerless. Resonance, the quality of being able to reinforce sound by sympathetic vibrations. Resonance, able to reinforce sound by sympathetic vibrations. Resonate, to have or produce resonance. Resource, that which is restored to, relied upon, or made available for aid or support. Respite, interval of rest. Resplendent, very bright. Respondent, answering. Restitution, restoration of anything to the one to whom it properly belongs. Resumption, the act of taking back or taking again. Resurgent, surging back or again. Resurrection, a return from death to life. Resuscitate, to restore from apparent death. Retaliate, to repay evil with a similar evil. Wretch, to make an effort to vomit. Retention, the keeping of a thing within one's power or possession. Reticence, the quality of habitually keeping silent or being reserved in utterance. Reticent, habitually keeping silent or being reserved in utterance. Retinue, the body of persons who attend a person of importance in travel or public appearance. Retort, a retaliatory speech. Retouch, to modify the details of. Retrace, to follow backward or toward the place of beginning as a track or marking. Retract, to recall or take back something that one has said. Retrench, to cut down or reduce an extent or quantity. Retrieve, to recover something by searching. Retroactive, operative on, affecting, or having reference to past events, transactions, responsibilities. Retrograde, to cause to deteriorate or to move backward. Retrogression, a going or moving backward or in a reverse direction. Retrospect, a view or contemplation of something past. Retrospective, looking back on the past. Reunite, to unite or join again, as after separation. Revelation, a disclosing, discovering, or making known of what was before secret, private, or unknown. Revere, to regard with worshipful veneration. Reverent, humble. Reversion, a return to or toward some former state or condition. Revert, to return or turn or look back as toward a former position or the like. Revile, to heap approach or abuse upon. Revisal, revision. Revise, to examine for the correction of errors or for the purpose of making changes. Revocation, repeal. Revoke, to rescind. Rhapsody, rapt or rapturous utterance. Rhetoric, the art of discourse. Rhetorician, a showy writer or speaker. Ribald, indulging in or manifesting coarse indecency or obscenity. Riddance, the act of ridding or delivering from something undesirable. Ridicule, looks or acts expressing amused contempt. Ridiculous, laughable and contemptible. Rife, abundant. Righteousness, rectitude. Rightful, conformed to a just claim according to established laws or usage. Rigmarole, nonsense. Rigor, inflexibility. Rigorous, uncompromising. Ripplet, a small ripple as of water. Risible, capable of exciting laughter. Rivulet, a small stream or brook. Robust, characterized by great strength or power of endurance. Rondo, a musical composition during which the first part or subject is repeated several times. Rookery, a place where crows congregate to breed. Rotary, turning around its axis like a wheel or so constructed as to turn thus. 
rotate, to cause to turn on or as on its axis as a wheel. Rote, repetition of words or sounds as a means of learning them with slight attention. Rotund, round from fullness or plumpness. Rudimentary, being in an initial, early, or incomplete stage of development. Rue, to regret extremely. Ruffian, a lawless or recklessly brutal fellow. Ruminant, chewing the cud. Ruminate, to chew over again as food previously swallowed and regurgitated. Rupture, to separate the parts of by violence. Rustic, characteristic of dwelling in the country. Ruth, sorrow for another's misery. Sacrifice, to make an offering of to deity, especially by presenting on an altar. Sacrificial, offering or offered as an atonement for sin. Sacrilege, the act of violating or profaning anything sacred. Sacrilegious, impious. Safeguard, to protect. Sagacious, able to discern and distinguish with wise perception. Salacious, having strong sexual desires. Salience, the condition of standing out distinctly. Salient, standing out prominently. Saline, constituting or consisting of salt. Salutary, beneficial. Salutation, any form of greeting, hailing, or welcome, whether by word or act. Salutatory, the opening oration at the commencement in American colleges. Salvage, any act of saving property. Salvo, a salute given by firing all the guns, as at the funeral of an officer. Sanctimonious, making an ostentatious display or hypocritical pretense of holiness or piety. Sanction, to approve authoritatively. Sanctity, holiness. Sanguinary, bloody. Sanguine, having the color of blood. Sanguineous, consisting of blood. Sapid, affecting the sense of taste. Sapience, deep wisdom or knowledge. Sapient, possessing wisdom. Sapiential, possessing wisdom. Saponaceous, having the nature or quality of soap. Sarcasm, cutting and reproachful language. Sarcophagus, a stone coffin or a chest-like tomb. Sardonic, scornfully or bitterly sarcastic. Satiate, to satisfy fully the appetite or desire of. Satire, the employment of sarcasm, irony, or keenness of wit in ridiculing vices. Satiric, resembling poetry in which vice, incapacity, or corruption is held up to ridicule. Satirize, to treat with sarcasm or derisive wit. Satyr, a very lascivious person. Savage, a wild and uncivilized human being. Savor, to perceive by taste or smell. Scabbard, the sheath of a sword or similar bladed weapon. Scarcity, insufficiency of supply for needs or ordinary demands. Scholarly, characteristic of an erudite person. Scholastic, pertaining to education or schools. Scintilla, the faintest ray. Scintillate, to emit or send forth sparks or little flashes of light. Scope, a range of action or view. Scoundrel, a man without principle. Scribble, hasty, careless writing. Scribe, one who writes or is skilled in writing. Script, writing or handwriting of the ordinary cursive form. Scriptural, pertaining to, contained in, or warranted by the Holy Scriptures. Scruple, doubt or uncertainty regarding a question of moral right or duty. Scrupulous, cautious in action for fear of doing wrong. Scurrilous, grossly indecent or vulgar. 
scuttle, to sink a ship by making holes in the bottom. Scythe, a long curved blade for mowing, reaping, etc. Seance, a meeting of spirituals for consulting spirits. Seer, to burn on the surface. Sebaceous, pertaining to or appearing like fat. Secant, cutting, especially in two parts. Secede, to withdraw from union or association, especially from a political or religious body. Secession, voluntary withdrawal from fellowship, especially from political or religious bodies. Seclude, to place, keep, or withdraw from the companionship of others. Seclusion, solitude. Secondary, less important or effective than that which is primary. Secondly, in the second place in order or succession. Second rate, second in quality, size, rank, importance, etc. Secrecy, concealment. Secretary, one who attends to correspondence, keeps records, or does other writing for others. Secretive, having a tendency to conceal. Sedate, even-tempered. Sedentary, involving or requiring much sitting. Sediment, matter that settles to the bottom of a liquid. Sedition, conduct directed against public order and the tranquility of the state. Seditious, promotive of conduct directed against public order and the tranquility of the state. Seduce, to entice to surrender chastity. Sedulous, persevering in effort or endeavor. Seer, a prophet. Seethe, to be violently excited or agitated. Seigneur, a title of honor or respectful address, equivalent to sir. Seismograph, an instrument for recording the phenomena of earthquakes. Seize, to catch or take hold of suddenly and forcibly. Selective, having the power of choice. Self-respect, rational self-esteem. Semblance, outward appearance. Semi-civilized, half-civilized, semi-conscious, partially conscious. Semi-annual, recurring at intervals of six months. Semi-circle, a half-circle. Seminar, any assemblage of pupils for real research in some specific study under a teacher. Seminary, a special school as of theology or pedagogics. Senile. Peculiar to or proceeding from the weakness or infirmity of old age. Sensation. A condition of mind resulting from spiritual or inherent feeling. Sense. The signification conveyed by some word, phrase, or action. Sensibility. Power to perceive or feel. Sensitive. Easily affected by outside operations or influences. Sensorium. The sensory apparatus. Sensual. Pertaining to the body or the physical senses. Sensuous. Having a warm appreciation of the beautiful or of the refinements of luxury. Sentence. A related group of words containing a subject and a predicate and expressing a complete thought. Sentience. Capacity for sensation or sense perception. Sentinel, any guard or watch stationed for protection. Separable, capable of being disjoined or divided. Separate, to take apart. Separatist, a seceder. Septennial, recurring every seven years. Sepulchre, a burial place. Sequacious, ready to be led. Sequel, that which follows in consequence of what has previously happened. Sequence. The order in which a number or persons, things, or events follow one another in space or time. Sequent. Following in the order of time. Sequester. The cause to withdraw or retire, as from society or public life. Sequestrate. To confiscate. 
Sergeant, a non-commissioned military officer ranking next above a corporal. Sergeant at Arms, an executive officer in legislative bodies who enforces the orders of the presiding officer. Sergeant Major, the highest non-commissioned officer in a regiment. Service, any work done for the benefit of another. Serviceable, durable. Servitude, slavery. Severance, separation. Severely, extremely. Sextet, a band of six singers or players. Sextuple, multiplied by six. Sheer, absolute. Shiftless, wanting in resource, energy, or executive ability. Shrewd, characterized by skill and understanding and profiting by circumstances. Shriek, a sharp, shrill outcry or scream caused by agony or terror. Shrinkage, a contraction of any material into less bulk or dimension. Shrivel, to draw or be drawn into wrinkles. Shuffle, a mixing or changing the order of things. Sibilance, a hissing sound. Sibilant, made with a hissing sound. Sibilate, to give a hissing sound to, as in pronouncing the letter S. Sidelong, inclining or tending to one side. Sidereal, pertaining to stars or constellations. Siege, a beleaguerment. Significance, importance. Significant, important, especially as pointing something out. Signification, the meaning conveyed by language, actions, or signs. Similar, bearing resemblance to one another or to something else. Simile, a comparison which directs the mind to the representative object itself. Similitude, similarity. Simplify, to make less complex or difficult. Simulate, imitate. Simultaneous, occurring, done, or existing at the same time. Sinecure, any position having emoluments with few or no duties. Singe, to burn slightly or superficially. Sinister, evil. Sinuosity, the quality of curving in and out. Sinuous, curving in and out. Sinus, an opening or cavity. Siren, a sea nymph described by Homer as dwelling between the island of Circe and Scylla. Sirocco, hot winds from Africa. Sisterhood, a body of sisters united by some bond of sympathy or by a religious vow. Skeptic, one who doubts any statements. Skepticism, the entertainment of doubt concerning something. Skiff, usually a small light boat propelled by oars. Skirmish, desultory fighting between advanced detachments of two armies. Slight, a trick or feat so deftly done that the manner of performance escapes observation. Slight, of a small importance or significance. Slothful, lazy. Sluggard, a person habitually lazy or idle. Sociable, inclined to seek company. Socialism, a theory of civil polity that aims to secure the reconstruction of society. Socialist, one who advocates reconstruction of society by collective ownership of land and capital. Sociology, the philosophical study of society. Soul, the sun. Solace, comfort in grief, trouble, or calamity. Solar, pertaining to the sun. Solder, a fusible alloy used for joining metallic surfaces or margins. Soldier, a person engaged in military service. Solicism, any violation of established rules or customs. Solicitor, one who represents a client in court of justice, an attorney. Solicitude, uneasiness of mind occasioned by desire, anxiety, or fear.
Soliloquy, a monologue. Solstice, the time of year when the sun is at its greatest declination. Soluble, capable of being dissolved as in a fluid. Solvent, having sufficient funds to pay all debts. Somber, gloomy. Somniferous, tending to produce sleep. Somnolence, oppressive drowsiness. Somnolent, sleepy. Sonata, an instrumental composition. Sonnet, a poem of fourteen decasyllabic or octosyllabic lines expressing two successive phrases. Sonorous, resonant. Soothsayer, one who claims to have supernatural insight or foresight. Sophism, a false argument understood to be such by the reasoner himself and intentionally used to deceive. Sophistical, fallacious. Sophisticate, to deprive of simplicity of mind or manner. Sophistry, reasoning sound in appearance only, especially when designedly deceptive. Soprano, a woman's or boy's voice of high range. Sorcery, witchcraft. Sordid, of degraded character or nature. Souvenir, a token of remembrance. Sparse, thinly diffused. Spartan, exceptionally brave, rigorously severe. Spasmonic, convulsive. Specialize, to assume an individual or specific character or adopt a singular or special course. Specialty. An employment limited to one particular line of work. Specie. A coin or coins of gold, silver, copper, or other metal. Species. A classificatory group of animals or plants subordinate to a genus. Specimen. One of a class of persons or things regarded as representative of the class. Specious. Plausible. Spectator. One who beholds or looks on. Spectre, apparition. Spectrum, an image formed by rays of light or other radiant energy. Speculate, to pursue inquiries and form conjectures. Speculator, one who makes an investment that involves a risk of loss, but also a chance of profit. Sphericity, the state or condition of being a sphere. Spheroid, a body having nearly the form of a sphere. Spherometer, an instrument for measuring curvature or radii of spherical surfaces. Spinous, having spines. Spinster, a woman who is never married. Spontaneous, arising from inherent qualities or tendencies without external efficient cause. Sprightly, vivacious. Spurious, not genuine. Squabble, to quarrel. Squalid, having a dirty, mean, poverty-stricken appearance. Squatter, one who settles on land without permission or right. Stagnant, not flowing, set of water, as in a pool. Stagnate, to become dull or inert. Stagnation, the condition of not flowing or not changing. Stagey, having a theatrical manner. Staid, of a steady and sober character. Stallion, an uncastrated male horse, commonly one kept for breeding. Stanchion, a vertical bar or a pair of bars used to confine cattle in a stall. Stanza, a group of rhymed lines, usually forming one of a series of similar divisions in a poem. Statecraft, the art of conducting state affairs. Preference, an object of favor or choice. Preferential, possessing, giving, or constituting preference or priority. Preferment, preference. Prefix, to attach at the beginning. Prehensible, capable of being grasped. Prehensile, adapted for grasping or holding. 
Prehension, the act of laying hold of or grasping. Prejudice, a judgment or opinion formed without due examination of the facts. Prelacy, a system of church government. Prelate, one of a higher order of clergy having direct authority over other clergy. Prelude, an introductory or opening performance. Premature, coming too soon. Premier, first in rank or position. Premise, a judgment as a conclusion. Premonition, foreboding. Preoccupation, the state of having the mind, attention, or inclination preoccupied. Preoccupy, to fill the mind of a person to the exclusion of other subjects. Preordain, to foreordain. Preparation, an act or proceeding designed to bring about some event. Preparatory, having to do with what is preliminary. Preponderant, prevalent. Preponderate, to exceed in influence or power. Prepossession, a preconceived liking. Preposterous, utterly ridiculous or absurd. Prerogative, having superior rank or precedence. Presage, to foretell. Prescience, knowledge of events before they take place. Prescient, foreknowing. Prescript, prescribed as a rule or model. Prescriptible, derived from authoritative direction. Prescription, an authoritative direction. Presentient, perceiving or feeling beforehand. Presentiment, foreboding. Presentment, semblance. Preservation, conservation. Presumption, that which may be logically assumed to be true until disproved. Presumptuous, assuming too much. Pretension, a bold or presumptuous assertion. Pretentious, marked by pretense, conceit, or display. Preternatural, extraordinary. Extraordinary. Pretext, a fictitious reason or motive. Prevalence, frequency. Prevalent, of wide extent or frequent occurrence. Prevaricate, to use ambiguous or evasive language for the purpose of deceiving or diverting attention. Prevention, thwarting. Prickle, to puncture slightly with fine, sharp points. Priggish, conceited. Prim, stiffly proper. Prima, first. Primer, an elementary reading book for children. Primeval, belonging to the first ages. Primitive, pertaining to the beginning or early times. Principal, most important. Principality, the territory of a reigning prince. Principal, a general truth or proposition. Priory, a monastic house. Pristine, primitive. Privateer, a vessel owned and officered by private persons but carrying on maritime war. Privilege, a right or immunity not enjoyed by all or that may be enjoyed only under special conditions. Privity, knowledge shared with another or others regarding a private matter. Privy, participating with another or others in the knowledge of a secret transaction. Probate, relating to making proof as of a will. Probation, any proceeding designed to ascertain or test character, qualification, or the like. Probe, to search through and through. Probity, virtue or integrity tested and confirmed. Procedure, a manner or method of acting. Proceed, to renew motion or action as after rest or interruption. Proclamation, any announcement made in a public manner. Procrastinate, to put off till tomorrow or till a future time. Procrastination, delay. 
Proctor, an agent acting for another. Prodigal, one wasteful or extravagant, especially in the use of money or property. Prodigious, immense. Prodigy, a person or thing of very remarkable gifts or qualities. Productive, yielding in abundance. Profession, any calling or occupation involving special mental or other special disciplines. Professor, a public teacher of the highest grade in a university or college. Proffer, to offer to another for acceptance. Proficiency, an advanced state of acquirement, as in some knowledge, art, or science. Proficient, possessing ample and ready knowledge or of skill in any art, science, or industry. Profile, an outline or contour. Profiteer, one who profits. Profligacy, shameless viciousness. Profligate, abandoned to vice. Profuse, produced or displayed in overabundance. Progeny, offspring. Progression, a moving forward or proceeding in course. Prohibition, a decree or an order forbidding something. Prohibitionist, one who favors the prohibition by law of the manufacture and sale of alcoholic beverages. Prohibitory, involving or equivalent to prohibition, especially of the sale of alcoholic beverages. Projection, a prominence. Proletarian, a person of the lowest or poorest class. Prolific, producing offspring or fruit. Prolix, verbose. Prologue, a prefatory statement or explanation to a poem, discourse, or performance. Prolong, to extend in time or duration. Promenade, to walk for amusement or exercise. Prominence, the quality of being noticeable or distinguished. Prominent, conspicuous in position, character, or importance. Promiscuous, brought together without order, distinction, or a design, for sex. Promissory, expressing an engagement to pay. Promontory, a high point of land extending outward from the coastline into the sea. Promoter, a furtherer, forwarder, or encourager. Promulgate, to proclaim. Propaganda, any institution or systematic scheme for propagating a doctrine or a system. Propagate, to spread abroad or from person to person. Propel, to drive or urge forward. Propellant, propelling. Propeller, one who or that which propels. Prophecy, any prediction or foretelling. Prophesy, to predict or foretell, especially under divine inspiration and guidance. Propitious, kindly disposed. Proportionate, being in proportion.